What's up guys, it's Kira here and welcome back to my channel. So today I am finally back with more IKEA hacks for you guys. So far on my channel I have two IKEA hacks. One of them is for a copper kind of rose gold lamp and then the other one is for a desk and it's a marble and rose gold desk. They're super cheap, they're super easy and oh my god did you guys love those videos. I think those two are among the highest viewed videos on my channel so if you haven't seen them definitely go check them out. I will leave a link to them below but now it is time to get back into it and I have about three new IKEA hacks that I can't wait to show you guys. And the first one is this one for a desk. So in this DIY, I'm going to show you how to take the simplest desk legs. They are so, so cheap and cheerful. I think it only costs about six euro for each leg and using a very simple can of spray paint and some primer and a little bit of know-how, you can turn it into something that looks so beautiful. So without rambling on too much, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I do it and then I will catch you at the end. So we are now down in the car park of my apartment building and we've just laid out all our bits and we're gonna do some of the spraying. I'm gonna show you what's happening here. Here we have the legs for a table. So I'm gonna spray these gold and I have my gold spray that I showed you guys. Now obviously when you're working with spray paint, you wanna be outside, it needs to be well ventilated. So we're here in the car park and obviously it's like all the air coming in there, so it's fine. We've got some masking tape if we need to tape up anything and all of my spray here so we've got some primer and then we have the metallic gold so it is the next day and i am back here down in the car park again and i've left these here to dry so yesterday i painted one side of them with the surface primer and i'm just going to turn them all over and spray the other side so i'm just using this gray surface primer um, it's pretty much the same price as the gold spray that I showed you. So I'm gonna prime them first and then I think I'm going to put the pieces together and then finish with the gold spray when they're assembled. Even with a primer and a top coat, I'm worried that I'll scratch the paint off when I assemble them. So the primer is gonna go on first, then I'm gonna assemble these legs and then I will spray them gold and hopefully be able to fix them to the table with like minimal scratching. So that's the plan. I'm also a little bit hungover, but that's okay. This is a nice kind of calming way to spend a Saturday or a Sunday morning, so let's do it. So I am back down in the car park, which by the way is creepy AF. If you guys don't hear from me again, I've died down here. I've assembled the two trestles. This is what they look like when they're all put together. Pretty easy to put together, I have to say. Um, you won't have a problem with that. I've basically done one coat of the gold paint, but it definitely needs at least one other coat. I might even do a third coat. I've put the primer on it, which really helps. I really, really recommend primer, guys. I think it just gives it that perfect base to work with. But so far, I'm really happy with it, and I'm just gonna give another coat of spray, leave that dry for another hour two hours if i can and then go in for a third coat there definitely are parts of it that need another coat they've dripped a little bit my spray painting method isn't the best like i know you're supposed to do really short little bursts but i just end up going and <laughs> covering the whole thing so yeah i'm gonna do another coat and hopefully it will start to really look gorgeous and even even though already it's looking pretty cool So here we have the desk in all its glory and guys, I'm so happy with how it came out. I'm just gonna come in for a closer look. As you can see here, the legs came out so beautifully. The finish looks amazing and that was only two coats with a primer underneath. Look at that gorgeous even finish. I definitely think I did a better job with this than I did with my first DIY. So you can see the gold legs peeking out from under the desk and it just looks so, so nice. I'm so impressed with it. So there you can see a better look at the finished desk. I'm so, so impressed with it. So there you have it guys. That was the latest installment in my IKEA hack series. I hope it lived up to the rest of the IKEA hacks that I have on my channel. And if you have not checked those out, you absolutely have to. I will leave them in the description below. I'll actually probably make a playlist of all my IKEA hacks and I will leave everything there so you can check that out and it will show you any recent ones that have been added since then. Let me know in the comments below what you think of my DIY and if this is something that you might attempt yourself. If you do end up doing this DIY then please 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 send me a picture. You can tag me on Instagram, on Twitter, on Facebook. My username is at Kira O'Doherty. It's the same on absolutely everything. I would love to see if you guys do this. I'm sure you'll probably do a better job than I did because I'm certainly no pro. If you liked this video then feel free to give it a thumbs up as that 
it helps me out a lot and if you have not already then be sure to subscribe to my channel I will leave a link in the end card after this and in the description below I post two new videos every single week and I would love to have you back for more thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next one bye you love me.